Guys, welcome back to the neighborhood. It's roofing day across the street, but it's first start day on the Baja Champions Edition, one of 1,000 made, super rare, the holy grail of super beetles right here in our driveway. Before we get into this, check out 5150 MXVW2. New content on that channel soon. That's my second channel. That's gonna be a little bit of everything. This will be mostly uh, the VW stuff. So, dual port AE, will it run? Does turn over. Hopefully it has more compression than that uh, that last engine I tried to start. No end play, that's good. So this beauty is for sale. If I get it running, it's $2,000. If I get it running. If I don't, it's $1,500. So, not gonna go crazy on this one. I don't think there's any fuel in it, but you always want to disconnect your fuel pump so you're not pumping fuel out of this right onto the exhaust. Ask me how I know about that. Yeah, that was a close one. Fire Marshal Bill would not have been happy about that. So yes, we are taking advantage of the last few warm days of fall here in New England. Dubworks has officially taken over the shop. He's currently doing a body off restoration on the 63 ragtop. All right, let's see where we're at here. Let's try and find timing. Oh, look at all that mousage, fantastic. All right, what do we got on this pulley? I'm not real familiar with these dual ports. I gotta look them up. These time, I think, after top dead. So that's probably 180. Can you see that notch? Yeah, there's one notch here. We're pointing to number three. So that's probably 180 because we want to come back around to number one. So let's see what that does for us. Then we'll pop that valve cover just to make sure. I'm pretty sure, I'll have to look it up, but I'm pretty sure they're five degrees after. I'm mostly a pre-68 guy. but. Let's just go with it. Make sure this is number one. Alright, so that would be number one. And that is going back to number one. Correct? Correct. Alright. They've got it set up correctly, but let's just give those points a clean. Get our rotor off. If you're doing your own car, obviously change the oil. Check your valves. Give it a fresh tune up, yada yada. Without my lift, I'm getting lazy in my old age. It's my birthday tomorrow, I'm 51, so. Crawling around this cold cement. Just for the kids. All right, let's make sure I didn't twist that thing uh, completely incorrectly. Yeah, one, four, three, two, all right. We're there. You know, I'm being really lazy today. I even brought the ultrasonic home. It's up to temp, it's ready. Do I take the carb off? I don't know guys, that carb doesn't look terrible either. I mean, I haven't had the top off. Oil looks pretty good, granted it's old. Carb doesn't look terrible. I'm just gonna trickle a little fuel in there. Let's just hear it pop off and then we'll go from there. Even someone has a battery tray. Wow, things are looking up for me in my Super Beetle. Get these clean real quick. Not too bad. Finally, 12 volt. Something I might have a shot at actually getting started. Ow! <laughs> That was Jen's favorite part of the uh, entire production. That was my head, yep. All right, step one, do we have dash lights? Oh yeah, there we go. You got radio? No radio. Unimportant, it's a realistic, not an Alpine. Dash lights, that's a good start. Do not get too excited. Let's hear it turn over first. Let's go. Oh, there it is. Ooh, 12 volt. I like it. 
What do you say we put a little two-stroke mix in the old blowhole and see if we can't get this thing to fire off, shall we? <laughs> I took my old buddy riding for the first time. We used to race in the 90s. And of course, I was on a 454 stroke. And it's this hot summer day and he's out there. He's got my, he's gonna put gas in my bike for me. And he's out there just shaking, shaking, shaking my gas. Sweat's pouring off him. And I'm just in the box van watching him. And I'm just laughing. And I said, hey Dave, that's a four stroke because he was on his two stroke because he hadn't ridden since the 90s. But it, was, it was funny to watch him shake the bejesus out of that, uh, out of my gas can. Oh, the good old days. Yeah, the, uh, the two stroke with the oil in it gives it a little more, you know, a little oil, a little, little lubrication for the rings. I don't think it's been sitting terribly long though. So I'm not going to put any in the bowl in case I do decide to pull the carburetor and there's junk in there. Let's just see if it'll pop off for us. We need a win. We need a win after the last one. Fire in the hole. Let's go. That should have just fired right off. And it did not. What, what, do we, what am I missing, guys? This is cake. This is cake. This is cake. I guess we gotta go check the timing. We got checked for spark. I mean, seriously, that sound didn't even sound. It wasn't even close. That thing. That that does that that doesn't sound good at all. It's just so nasty in there. You know, I got all that in there. Let's make sure these are actually connected. Oh, it's so gross. Is that even... All right, let's check for spark at the points. Here we go. Deja vu. Let's see what we got here. It's my big head in the way. Points are opening and closing. Good. Are they closing? I don't have any spark at the points. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> I was looking for a four minute video here, guys. Not a musty one marathon, figuring out what's wrong with it. Got no spark, we got power there? Yeah, we got power. So why aren't the points sparking? Nope. What do we got, another condenser? Got no spark. I can tell you if you did a family feud of top things Jason has on all his VWs, one of them would be bad condensers. So I don't have very many parts here, but I'm gonna see if I have a condenser. If not, I might have a distributor. I'll just drop in there. 280, I might have that. 280, all right, we're going, uh, I think that's 280. We're gonna throw a condenser in there. Before we pull that, let's get this. Back to the notch. Come on. All right. Yeah, the condenser wire, hmm, that could be part of our problem. All right guys, well I went and installed the new condenser. 
We finally got spark to the points. I adjusted them. We didn't have spark at the points. I adjusted the points. Now, let's see if we have spark to the plugs. I don't have my jumper button here. It's at the shop, but let's see what we got. I think I can see it from here. Oh, there we go. Nice. So we've got spark. Now we need timing. Let's just make sure we're not 180 out. I got the valve cover off. All right, number one is not moving. So that is top dead center. Valves look good too. This thing needs to run. I'm getting angry. Just something. Well, there it is. A little timing. <laughs> well, it's about time. Okay. So we know it's a runner. Should I pull the... Let me pull the... Let's just see if it'll run on uh, on the hole. Well, it runs. So guys, that's it for this one. I'm not gonna spend a ton of time on this. It's for sale, 2,000 or best offer. I gotta jump on a bunch of other dead things in the yard while we have beautiful weather the next couple days. So thank you guys for dropping in. Check out the other channel, 5150MXBW2, for some content on all my dead things in the yard. Thank you guys again. And uh, I don't know, it's a beautiful day. And it's not gonna be good for that much longer so gotta take advantage of it so thank you guys for dropping in i'll be getting a few more vids out this week so stay tuned for those take care guys guys i've been trying to shoot an outro for about an hour and the tapping just the tapping right here is tapping is that from a happy gilmore from a adam stanley movie i gotta get it together this is the last out show i've done about a lot Okay, ready? Here we go. Guys, that's gonna do it for this one. <laughs> I gotta look up the movie. Right here is tapping. Just tapping in. Is that Sandler? I know it's Happy Gilmore. Just tap it in. What's the tap? All right. Oh my god, I'm just not even gonna do one. Just gonna go to the store. All right, guys, so thanks for dropping in. I've got school buses driving by. John's leaf blowing his heart out. The neighbor across the street's got his roof being put on. All I hear is tapping, tap, tap, tap. I've got a mouse nest force in this thing. So I'm gonna jump on this. If you wanna see this, 5150MX2. You guys have a great few days. We've got more content coming out real soon. John, you're killing me. That thing's ended, now we just have the snow blow up here. Oh, there it is. Tap, 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 tap a root. My microphone picks up all this, too. So if you want to hear more tapping and more, can I say blowing? More leaf blowing, tune in to the next episode. You guys, have a great couple of days. I can't do any more outros. This is it. I've done about 700. We'll see you soon. Thank you. Take care. Wow. I'm done with leaves. I did them yesterday. Can you tell? All right. Gotta get this card waved off.